one of the raps that millennials take or, or folks who are younger in a, a workforce with older folk, because I've experienced that too, believe it or not, <laughs> is that um, you have to realize that you don't know it all. And um, I yeah. wonder if that is a, a maturity thing uh, less than a millennial thing. You know, cause there, yeah, there's some, I think it's a maturity thing. Okay, because there's some old fools too. Yeah. They feel like they know it all. You know, like like it can yeah. be reverse. It, it, you know, yeah. like uh, someone yeah. telling you, "Well, I I know how to text," and then they send their dick pics to. <laughs> <laughs> right, and it's like, come on, you should be using text to talk, or you could be swiping. It's so much easier. <laughs> Oh God! Just just the it's, thought of some geri- of, geriatric dick pic. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's oh, like oh, instead oh. of saying, <sighs> "What are you doing?" You could be like, "Wyd." <laughs> or what did you say? Say I was like, "What is oik?" It was O I C. I was like, "Uh, okay." Uh, mm. Yes, yeah, O I C. Yeah. So you know, uh, I guess what? Uh, maybe I'm skipping ahead, but I, I, I don't understand the dick pic. Uh, I don't. I don't see how someone goes. This will close the deal. Snap. Send. I don't, I don't get that. Is it a millennial thing? I think the first one I got, I was like, ah, <laughs> clutch the pearls. I did. And, and it's always unsolicited. Yes. So it's always unsolicited. I, yeah, is that? I think that may be a millennial thing because I've never gotten a God forbid I get a, a Gen X dick pic, like a fifty year old dick pic, you know, just <laughs> hanging junk. Oh God, just the thought. Anyway, I've, I've gotten some of those too, believe it or not. Um, yeah, hmm. so is it a millennial thing is, or like what? Yeah, what is the? <sighs> I I do. I think it's not only a millennial thing, but I think it's. Um, this society with <laughs> society. Media. Oh, okay. Uh-huh. Yes. Okay. With social media, mm-hmm. phones, and pictures, and people that are gaining fame from. Ah. You know, you're, you're, look, you look at your Kim, like Kim Kardashian. Girl. Like, I, I watched Death Hilarious yesterday, and she said she 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 was a comedian from Baltimore, mm-hmm. and she. She she had it exactly right. She was like, "Oh, Kim Kardashian, if she hadn't, you know, released that sex tape, she'd be still cleaning the closets of Paris Hilton." Mm-hmm. And that's so true. Like, no one knew who she was. She was Paris's plus one. Oh, <laughs> she was who was plus one? Paris oh, Paris Hilton. Hilton. Plus yeah, one. yeah. Well, well, too. Uh, I th- gone are the days, and I think about. Uh, I'll touch on this when I interview someone from the Greatest Generation. But I remember uh, that actor Robert Mitchum in 1948. He was caught smoking weed, and they thought, "Oh my God, my career's over." And I just find <laughs> that so quaint now. I think if he oh, was still, yeah. if he was still alive, he'd be like, well, "What's the big deal?" Where and I think I with. Wish. With We've evolved. Yeah. Like, like I, I'm trying to think of, oh, like, or Vanessa Williams, you know, she is, we are of the same oh, generation. Yeah. She's my girl crush, my fellow orange woman, woo woo, with the whole <laughs> n- naked pictures. Stripped, right? Stripped of she her crown. Of her title. So flash yeah. ahead, I think in 2015, the pageant apologized to her and they said we were so sorry, you know, so, so mm-hmm. uh, times have definitely changed. So uh, I guess yeah. some, somewhere down the line, <laughs> Uh, uh, someone running for office. I, I hope Andrew Gillum hasn't sent anyone <laughs> dick pics. <or laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, he's well. He's kind of at the like the tail end of the Gen X. So, so yeah. But I think we'll come to a point where someone will just yawn about that and go, "Oh, yeah, mm, yawn." Anyway. Right. 